Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about 7 things you should avoid doing in the morning by all means. Mornings can be a hectic time, and it's easy to fall into bad habits that can set the tone for the rest of the day. So, let's get started with our list. Number 1. When our alarm goes off in the morning, it can be tempting to hit snooze and stay in bed for just a few more minutes. However, this can actually do more harm than good. When we hit snooze and go back to sleep, our body starts a new sleep cycle, which we then interrupt when the alarm goes off again a few minutes later. This can leave us feeling groggy and even more tired than if we had just gotten up when the alarm went off the first time. Hitting snooze can also affect our circadian rhythm, the internal clock that regulates our sleep and wake cycles. When we hit snooze, we disrupt our natural sleep cycle and confuse our body's internal clock, which can make it harder to wake up and feel alert throughout the day. So, what can we do instead of hitting snooze? One option is to set your alarm for the time you actually need to wake up, rather than setting it early and relying on snooze to give you a few extra minutes of sleep. This can help you avoid the negative effects of hitting snooze and make it easier to wake up and start your day feeling refreshed. Number 2. Don't skip breakfast. Breakfast is often referred to as the most important meal of the day, and for good reason. It provides our body with the energy and nutrients we need to start our day off on the right foot. When we skip breakfast, we deprive our body of this important fuel, which can leave us feeling tired, sluggish, and even irritable throughout the day. Skipping breakfast can also affect our metabolism, which is the process by which our body converts food into energy. When we skip breakfast, our metabolism slows down, which can make it harder to burn calories and maintain a healthy weight. Also, it can lead to overeating later in the day. When we skip breakfast, we may feel hungrier later on and be more likely to overindulge in unhealthy snacks and meals. Skipping breakfast may seem like a time-saving strategy, but it can actually do more harm than good. By making time for a healthy breakfast, you can provide your body with the fuel it needs to start your day off right and maintain your energy levels throughout the day. Number 3. Don't check your phone first thing in the morning. When we wake up in the morning, it can be tempting to reach for our phones right away to check our messages, emails, and social media notifications. When we check our phones first thing in the morning, we expose ourselves to a flood of information that can be overwhelming and stressful. Checking your phone in the morning could also set a negative tone for the rest of your day. If you wake up to a barrage of work emails or negative news headlines, you may start your day feeling stressed and anxious, which can affect your mood and productivity throughout the day. Another downside to checking your phone first thing in the morning is that it can interfere with your ability to focus and be present in the moment. Instead of starting your day with intention and mindfulness, you may find yourself scrolling mindlessly through social media or responding to work emails, which can distract you from the things that really matter. So, what can you do instead of checking your phone first thing in the morning? You can establish a morning routine that doesn't involve technology. This could be something as simple as stretching or meditating or enjoying a cup of coffee. Another option is to wait until you've completed your morning routine or eaten breakfast before checking your phone. This can help you avoid the negative effects of checking your phone first thing in the morning and start your day on a more positive and intentional note. Number 4. Don't rush through your morning routine. Many of us have busy schedules and packed mornings, which can make it tempting to rush through our morning routines in order to save time. This could make us forget important tasks or make mistakes that can cause us stress and frustration. Rushing through your morning routine can also affect your mental health and well-being. It can leave you feeling frazzled and stressed, which can set a negative tone for the rest of your day. By taking the time to slow down and focus, you can reduce your stress levels and start your day off on a more positive note. So, what can you do instead of rushing through your morning routine? You can wake up a little earlier in order to give yourself more time. This may mean going to bed a little earlier or setting your alarm a few minutes earlier, but it can make a big difference in your morning routine. Number 5. Don't load your body with sugar in the morning. Many of us love to start our day with a sweet treat, such as a donut, muffin, or sugary cereal. When we eat high sugar foods in the morning, we may experience a spike in our blood sugar levels, which can lead to a crash later on in the day. Consuming a lot of sugar in the morning can also contribute to weight gain and other health problems, such as diabetes and heart disease. Another downside to loading your body with sugar in the morning is that it can interfere with your ability to focus and be productive. When we consume high sugar foods, our bodies may produce insulin, which can cause us to feel tired and lethargic. So, what can you do instead of loading your body with sugar? Choose a breakfast that is low in sugar and high in nutrients. This could be something like a bowl of oatmeal with fresh fruit, a vegetable omelet, or a smoothie made with vegetables and protein powder. Number 6. Don't drink coffee right away. Many of us love to start our day with a cup of coffee to help wake us up and get us going. However, drinking coffee first thing in the morning may not be the best choice for our bodies. When we drink coffee on an empty stomach, it can cause our bodies to produce more acid, which can lead to digestive problems such as heartburn and acid reflux. Drinking coffee first thing in the morning can also interfere with our body's natural cortisol levels. Cortisol is a hormone that helps regulate our energy levels and wake us up in the morning. 
When we drink coffee too early in the day, it can disrupt our cortisol levels and interfere with our body's natural rhythms. Another downside to drinking coffee right away in the morning is that it can cause us to become dependent on caffeine to function. When we rely too heavily on caffeine, it can lead to a cycle of needing more and more to feel awake and alert. So, what can you do instead of drinking coffee right away? Wait until you've had breakfast to have your first cup of coffee. This can help reduce the acidity in your stomach and give your body time to wake up naturally. Another option is to try switching to a different morning beverage, such as herbal tea or hot water with lemon. These beverages can help hydrate your body and give you a natural boost of energy without the negative side effects of coffee. Number 7. Don't let negativity creep in. Many of us start our day by checking our phones or watching the news, which can often lead to feelings of stress and negativity. When we allow negative thoughts and emotions to take over in the morning, it can set the tone for the rest of our day. Negativity can also have physical effects on our bodies, such as increasing our heart rate and causing muscle tension. When we start our day feeling stressed and anxious, it can be difficult to focus on our work or enjoy our daily activities. To avoid this you can practice mindfulness or meditation first thing in the morning. This can help you start your day with a clear and positive mindset and reduce feelings of stress and anxiety. Another option is to set aside some time for self-care in the morning, such as stretching, journaling, or reading a book. This can help you focus on your own needs and goals, rather than being bombarded with negative news and social media. It's also important to be mindful of the people and activities you surround yourself with in the morning. If there are certain people or situations that tend to bring you down, try to avoid them or limit your exposure to them in the morning. And there you have it, 7 things you should avoid doing in the morning. Remember, the way you start your day can set the tone for the rest of the day. By avoiding these morning mistakes, you can set yourself up for a productive and positive day ahead. Thanks for watching.